Hello my loves, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is sponsored by Arabella Hair and of course we are doing a tutorial on how to install a frontal wig. So this wig is a bob but it's very curly and gorgeous. I have already plucked it. Um, it came pre plucked but I did a little bit of plucking myself. So it basically went from this to this. So now I am putting it on just to see how it looks. Um, before I actually take it off and apply a bit of foundation on it and let me tell you I'm obsessed already the texture of the hair is super soft and it's really really beautiful the frontal the frontal is so gorgeous oh I also did bleach the knots um, it came and I just bleached the knots even though I didn't show you guys the process but I did so yeah I am obsessed already and I'm going to cut off the excess lace, the lace that I'm not going to need. And only then will I install the wig. But you guys, as I'm telling you guys, this wig is gorgeous. But I kind of had to trust the process a bit because you can see how it looks. <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm going to add a bit of got to be styling gel together with free spray. Um, this has been really helpful to me because in installing all my wigs, especially because I want this wig to last for a day or two, um, I just use these two products and it will last, especially because this lace is gorgeous, um, it's giving and as you can see, I haven't even finished installing yet but i am just loving it so this elastic band will help me attach my hairline together with the lace and yeah oh my god this hair looks so good on me i am loving it okay it's safe to say i'm obsessed so i'm going to brush it with a detangling brush to make sure that there is no tangling and as you can see it is not shedding at all and that was one of the highlights also for me so i'm going to use mousse to give it that bouncy curl kind of thing you know because this wig came like this but i just want it to be curly and bouncy so mousse it really helps with that if you want the process to be quicker or if you or if you want to save yourself the mousse you can just spray it with water first and then use the mousse but i'm just going to use this because you know i can now back to the install so as you can see it's already looking flawless even though i have a few finishing touches that i need to do um, most especially just cutting the lace because <laughs> yeah it's needed um and as you can see it's lifting I'm just going to spray free spray again just on top of the lace and I'm just going to press it with the finger to make sure that it is laid because I want this wig laid to the guards and as you can see it's working pretty well this is how it looks at a close up and again the elastic band to make sure that it is flat 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 so I always say that you need a wig stick and a hood comb when you are a wig lover and uh, this is the last thing that I'm going to do. So I'm just going to use a wig stick together with a hot comb and I'm just going to comb it a bit to make it look a bit more realistic um, so that we get that wet lace effect. So I'm going to put the hot comb in a lower setting because I do not want it to ruin the curls and as you can see this is how it looks. So I'm going to part it and I wanted to do a middle part because I feel like that's the only thing that matters. So yeah, I did a middle part again with the wax stick and the hot comb to make sure that it is laid flat and so it looks natural. Who can tell this is not my real hair? I mean, look at it. I'm not even done yet, but <laughs> wow so yeah i'm going to wipe uh where i just put on free spray where i didn't need it just to make sure that it's neat and beautiful and then i'm going to pat foundation on to blend the lace together with my actual face and this is how it looks 
I am so proud of this install. It is so gorgeous. I plucked it really, really well. And wow. <laughs> That's all I can say. I mean, wow. So if you're also interested in this hair, you will find everything on the description box below. I will list everything and the link to Arabella hair store because if their curls can look like this imagine their other textures so be sure to check them out everything is on the description box below thank you so much for tuning in and for watching i am obsessed look at this <laughs> it's so bouncy and curly i love it so yeah i will see you on my next video bye for now be sure to buy this hair you need this unit okay you need it bye